Hi Virgo! This is your weekly day-by-day -day tarot cards reading by Emma for the week starting 22nd of March 2021. I'm going to draw two cards per day every day of this week. Monday, 22nd March and you have Queen of Swords. Tuesday, Three of Cups. Wednesday, Page of Wands, Thursday, Three of Swords, Four of Cups, Friday, Nine of Cups, Saturday, and Six of Cups, Sunday. Six of Pentacles, your influencing energy. We will see what is about once I pair it with another card. So, now Queen of Swords on Monday with Three of Pentacles, uh, Three of Cups Tuesday with Strength, Page of Wands with Ten of Pentacles, Three of Swords with um, Knight of Wands, Four of Cups with King of Swords, Nine of Cups with Nine of Pentacles and a Six of Cups on Sunday with a Three of Wands. Your influencing energy is Ten of Cups, just being happy. You know, you were just happy about some money that you received. Some, suddenly you received some money. It came unexpectedly. I don't know, yearly bonus, half a year bonus, I don't know, quarterly bonus in the company or something. But happiness by all means with something that you did receive. Okay, maybe somebody just help you with something and, and it was sudden and it was unexpected. You were in need of that. I don't know, help, that advice, that money, that something. And somebody just came, you know, by and said, okay, I'll help you. There's money, there's my advice, that my time for you, or, or whatever that makes you endlessly happy. That kind of energy was important, actually, even for this week, that how you came into this week. Very happy, in fact. Now, Queen of Swords in your environment, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius person, maybe your boss, maybe mother, somebody who's, I don't know, rather, rather intelligent, okay, very factual, very logical, but, but still caring energy. Um, it's always with Queen like that, cares about you, perhaps. This one won't worry much about how you feel about things. It's going to tell you facts. I mean, situation is... I don't know, as it is. And that's what you're going to get from this person. Just the facts, just logic, just knowledge, that kind of person that you have in your environment. But look, it is about something that is your skill, something that you, perhaps you're still learning, but doing it quite well, you are enjoying. This person is perhaps there to advise you, maybe just to objectively tell you this is job well done, this is not. You see, just to point objectively to that work that you do. Perhaps something like that on Monday, but it will be very objective. Well, whatever is a good job, it will. it is good job, what is not, it's not. That's what you're going to get from this um, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius person, this Queen of Swords in your environment. Now, Three of Cups, it's sort of celebration that you have, and it seems to me you were not up to that at all some sort of celebration it's not um, it's not something big it's a short lived uh, energy emotions are very high and i believe virgo you are there on tuesday just because you have to be there you you'd rather to be at home or somewhere else or you know with strength energy you will attend that i don't know celebration small celebration whatever but as i said you will need some strength and power to control yourself to join these people and to kind of to show happiness you would perhaps be tired or rather to be somewhere else you were not up to that that's for sure Page of Wands on Wednesday with Ten of Pentacles. No, Ten of Pentacles, it's always good. That's all about money. It's about some success. It's about successful completion. It's about buying something that you really like. This is excitement about something new. Maybe you bought something new that is going to be very useful to you. Some machine, some computer, some, I don't know what, something that 
makes you very excited. It Ten of Pentacles, it's purchasing something as well, something that is useful, something that you wanted to have. And this energy of excitement and, for, and, and eagerness is there in your environment. You are just loving it. Could be that you are receiving some money, could be that you are planning something new, because this is completion, completing some situation. And it's very successful completion, brings some money, brings success, brings happiness. You know, everybody is happy in here and it's many people involved there, not just you. You are completing some, something 100%. I always said with this <laughs> Ten of Pentacles, this is 100%. And that's what you've got down there in your environment, that is 100%. Because that's what you like. You are very happy in here, very excited about something in your environment. Maybe you're dealing with somebody who is younger than you, some child in there that is, I don't know, doing something, some project or so, and you are there to help. But I really feel that it is about you. You are onto something new and you are very happy about it, very enthusiastic about the new things that you do. That's enthusiasm again from Page of Wands into Knight of Wands. I really feel that is you in here. You either bought something, as I said, something really, something that you really want and makes you so happy, something that's going to be useful, something that you're going to enjoy, uh, not just today, but later on as well. Uh, with Knight of Wands, that is some excitement. Or art, that is being very happy. Um, and creative. Uh, now, Knight of Wands is very creative energy. You want to be in many places. You want to do things. This one wand, this Knight of Wands, is holding in its hand. It's that idea, that's beautiful, brilliant idea, that idea that you are onto. You, with that idea from Wednesday, oh, you are moving forward with that. You would like to do that, I don't know, 200 per hour. Every day every moment you see what I'm saying whatever that your idea is here I'm not talking about idea whatever it is but I'm talking about you being so excited this is such a fire okay be careful all right on this day if a uh, situation turns that is not really favorable with the Knight of Wands sometimes happens like that you are rushing towards that idea You've got your goal. You want to do that. You want to create something in your life, some situation. All right. You are going with plenty of excitement and you might lose your way. Okay, because this is jumpy energy. It goes from, okay, beginning well, jump into something unfortunate and you don't know where you are. Just suddenly after that, things happen in your favor. And end of the day, you finish, you've done, you created, you completed that what you wanted to complete. You see what I'm saying? Just beware of that characteristics of this energy that it can take you to hot and cold, you know with this one. But good thing is that you will, what you want to achieve, you will achieve. Okay, with this Knight of Wands. It's a bit method is problematic. Might, might actually annoy you end of the day. <laughs> heartbroken in here, eh? You might be annoyed with yourself, no end, all right? Because it's not you. You are not handling this energy very well. So these three of swords could actually be just you, that you were not happy with yourself, the way you conduct yourself, where you do things, because this isn't methodical, this isn't system is here, this is random, this is chaotic. <laughs> you see what I'm saying? And these three of of swords could be just that, that you are annoyed about yourself, about the way that you conduct yourself, simple as that. But you will manage, you will do whatever that you need to do, Yeah, but just this way it's going to be a bit annoying to you. Could have somebody else in your environment coming to talk to you, to complain, to, I don't know, tell you about its troubles, but you are not the right listener, you are not listener in here, all right? You uh, are all about your stuff, your things, something exciting that is happening in your life. Now, Four of Cups in your environment, disappointment, disappointment and King of Swords within you. This is intellect and logic, very stable mind, very stable, um, very specific knowledge, very useful knowledge that you have perhaps on this day. But I think that offer that you receive on, uh, on Friday, friendship, love offer, 
offer for whatever situation to go party or anything you are not happily accepting it I, I, I think you are not accepting it at all perhaps you are feeling tired you are not up to it even here okay on this Tuesday with this three of cups you force yourself to join the party now at this day you will not do that at all you'll not you will not go for it you will nicely reject it okay king of wands is just having clarity i don't want it for myself and that's it and you will say it nicely politely you will say it and that's it lovely saturday though okay we do have this nine of pentacles achiever you know i know this virgo energy virgo likes this energy this is very suitable number nine nine of pentacles the hermit nine also it's very suitable for virgo person bringing things up to an end taking care of details finishing everything tidy you see what i'm saying you feel yourself as an achiever on saturday Today you've done something and you're very successful or you you receive some money perhaps you feel that you perhaps bought some something very luxurious and you are enjoying it on Saturday that what you bought on Wednesday if there is that good shopping day <laughs> you know something like that with the nine of Pentacles everything is luxurious you are proud of yourself looking good feeling good you see what I'm saying everything is there to your satisfaction just what you wanted for yourself, being very happy, you are happy with yourself, whatever, career success, business success, money earn, um, beautiful dress both, suits you perfectly, maybe just something like that, whatever that is, I'm sure you did understand energy of being happy with yourself, of something that you achieved, or you get for yourself, it's just for yourself, this is not other people involved here at all, it's just you, and something that you really wanted for yourself, those shoes, that dress, you wanted it, always wanted this evening dress to have in your wardrobe, you see, something like that perhaps, could be something more meaningful, or, but definitely you achieve you've got that what you wanted for yourself and it is a bit luxurious belongs only to you three of wands with six of cups waiting for waiting for something waiting for somebody now we do have this six of cups in your environment which is kind of that nostalgic energy remembering i don't know old friends from your childhood, somebody that you used to work with and you did have a lovely relationship with that person, um, somebody you went vacation with some time ago, you lost contact with that person. You see what I'm saying? Remembering that beautiful things with another. Now, perhaps you, you wanted to stay in touch with that person, perhaps you did stay in touch with that person, you find it on, I don't know, on the social media somewhere but this is waiting waiting for response waiting for this person maybe you make some contact you uh, offered your love friendship you see what i'm saying somewhere on saturday you invited maybe some person somebody like that over but you are waiting for response this is always waiting for something. But you you were brave in there. You know, that person you haven't seen for a very long time and you said, okay, I'm going to call it. I'm going to be first. Even it's 15 years since. <laughs> you see, could be something like that. I'm just seeing it like that because it's Sunday. But uh, with a Six of Cups, I don't know. I think it is that relationship with people, communicating, communicating a lot with people. But you are still waiting to see how this person going to respond you are initiating that communications or that get together on sunday and uh, you will see i mean what is going to happen will this person now be again friendly and things will be just as they used to be earlier on or it's going to be something else now that is still to be seen okay perhaps just something like that on sunday by all means virgo enjoy your week